We got our truck locked and loaded. We got Mob Bear's duffel bag, my duffel bag back there. Take a stroller. We will not forget his stroller anymore. So for sure got a stroller. Got his hiking pack over there, an inflatable thing in case we want to swim in one of the hotel pools. And then most importantly, we got his food and all this cooler thing. This thing is doesn't want to open, but I got his milk, fruits, all kinds of stuff, stock full of ice. There are a couple bottles of water in there. And then since we're on the road, we should always have water. Got that. And we're also bringing the bikes. We're gonna go on a little bit, uh, on a, hopefully a couple of bike rides. Around. I'm sure it's gonna be beautiful, like in Sequoia, Yosemite, all that. And uh, one thing that's different is Taika is now on this side of the truck. We're trying this for a change. Hey Taika, say good morning. And usually Taika's on the other side of the truck, but um, since it's a long road trip, we want Mobber to be able to reach diagonally and be able to uh, take care of him because when he's right behind her, it's convenient for me, but I'm driving. So uh, we moved Taika to the other side. And then, so this side is all storage. We have the dishwashing detergent I showed you guys yesterday. We got blankets. Get the kitty cat. Oh, you found the kitty cat? Yeah. Oh, kitty. We got his little mattress for his pack and play. We got everything ready to go, locked and loaded. About to get the show on the road. We're at a first stop, Bakersfield, California, apparently. Not too much things going on around here. We just got mountains, fields, as far as the eye can see. And some sprinklers going off. Water in this here dry desert. We got Ma Bear over here. Put on some fucking little chonclays on a little dew. Have them walk around, you know, get his little wiggly wigglers out. Meanwhile, I'm going to get him some milk. And I'm actually really proud of this because uh, I packed his food. So I feel like I've been helping out. And uh, we gotta get this bike thing ready. So gotta unhitch this and take this apart. Take to take out milk. His fresh little refrigeration unit milk. Take this and this thing just swings right out like this. See? See? Some bad shit right here. It's pretty funny. Hey, little guy. Doing really good. What's pretty funny is um, I get so excited over dad shit now. Like the fact that this thing swung out, I'm like so cool. So, so cool. And then uh, I got to yeah, grab the cooler. Yeah. You can hold this camera for me real quick, Mama? Sure got it, baby. Grab the cooler. Check this out, Mama. We got all of Taika's little... Can I put Taika up here? Okay, can you grab it back? No, just show, I just want to show them what right, I got. The right. goods. See? All this stuff. Nice and cool. Feel it. Ooh la la. There's that. There's that milk. Your, your daddy loves you so much. You got your little milky milk, mister. Ooh, yummy. Ooh, that's fell off. The milky milk. Are you hungry? Not yet, but we can let it chill out. Put it in here. Give me one of his little packs. Yep. A little snack pack? Yeah, you can put it. Okay, I got it. A little road trip update. We are only an hour away from our destination now and we're on Kings Canyon Road. And Kings Canyon Road is the entry point uh, from where we're coming from into Sequoia National Park. So you can tell that the terrain has completely changed already. <laughs> Marbra's dancing with Taika to the music. I was doing it to the beat for a little bit. Yeah, so it's the entry point into um, Sequoia. So you can kind of tell how like all of a sudden we came from desert. Well, actually you guys never saw that. We're, well, in Bakersfield it was hella desert. And now you have all these rock formations and it just turns into all these mountains out there. Wow, that's crazy going on. 
and it just turns into these mountains out there and all these mountain ranges start forming out of uh, nowhere now. So that's where we're headed and uh, we should be there shortly in an hour. Are you excited little Kunitaika? Oh yeah. You excited? What about you mom? Are you excited? We're about to go to the National Forest. Yeah, I can't wait. It's going to be so beautiful. I'm just with this kid because he was just getting so anxious. So we had to pull over and get him out of his seat for a little bit so he could stretch his legs. <laughs> you mean what? He's like, why are you talking shit about me? Wah. Don't air my dirty laundry out there. Stop it. Thank you. Just checked in. Haven't brought our stuff into the room yet, but I can already tell that this is a beautiful place because just in front of us is a beautiful ass view. Check it out. Look at that. Wow. It's so beautiful, this lakes. We're definitely gonna take a picture there later. And um, we're just getting ready. A lot of the stuff here is not like a traditional hotel. It's like a lodge. So we have to walk and hike a little bit, but uh, we're in the loading zone. So we could take all our stuff here and then go into our lodge, into our room, which I'll show you in a little bit. And then afterwards, I have to park our car over there. And then uh, we can either go explore or it might just be in time for dinner. And so this place provides uh, breakfast and dinner, which is really, really cool. Cause that just takes a lot of headache out, especially since when you're out in the woods, there's not too many restaurants and so we don't have to go back into town. We could just eat here. So I'm really happy I found this lodge. I was just gonna, just gonna make, oh my God. I was gonna say it's gonna make our life so much easier, but. He is wearing the CUNY Barbell Brigade sweater. You <laughs> be CUNY, dude. Just got in our room, and how cute is this room? So, of course, we got the bed for the parents, but there's also two bunk beds, even though this guy doesn't even need to sleep on a bed yet. But I could totally see us having a family. I don't know if we're gonna have four kids. We already have a family, weirdo. I mean, but like a bigger family. I know where we all like have to bond and hang out in a room like this. This is so freaking cool. You like it? You want some brothers and sisters to fill up this room, mister? Cute you guy. Lover's getting everything settled in. We set up the uh, play pen here. Why did you set it up? Do you think it's the best? Yeah, because we're. I want to sleep with the fan on because there's not much air circulating here. And if yeah. we open those windows, it's right underneath or right above the trash that smells like garbage. Oh, yeah. true. Uh, so this is the only spot where the air is not hitting him right in the face. True. Smart move. Yeah. I also put the trash can up here uh, so that he doesn't ransack it. You know when you guys go out in nature and you have to set your trash to avoid bears? Uh, you have like a either a bear uh, bear barrel or all, all stuff like that. That's baby. That's, that's yeah, pretty much with babies. You have to imagine you have a little bear cub that's just going to ransack everything. Like this guy's already trying to figure out a way to break that. So that's why the minute I came in here, look, if that goes up here, he doesn't know how to operate zippers yet, so we can keep that here. But everything else you have to keep out of his reach, or else he's gonna ransack everything. Man, he's drilling a lot. He must be teasing like crazy right now. I'm really excited to find out about this part of the lodge because this is really family friendly. So there's this 24 hour service. So come here. We got latte machine water, um, hot water, coffee. Pete's coffee. Pete's coffee, dude, name brand. If you come on this side, uh, there's milk, which is what I just got in here. I like how somebody actually drew this. I know, that's cute. And this is what he drinks, the D-milk, 24 hour cereal. And they even give you bread to uh, feed the fish. I wonder which ones the kids like. <laughs> Probably. And they even give you leftover bread to feed the fish because there's that lake out there. Oh, cool. So, oh. oh, we could probably give him maybe. Oh, yeah, ducks. Ducks are usually. Yes, you might not even see the fish. Yeah. But yeah, so that's really cool. It's really family friendly. Um, oh, and there's also a lemonade, orange juice bar. Sunkissed baby. Oh, yeah, an iced tea. So, Arnold Palmer, technically, too. Yeah, here's the, the living area. I wonder if it's ever so hot. Yeah, so it's like a lodge, and I think dinner time, everyone just comes down community style. And, uh, from six to seven. Here, baby. Hip, hip, hooray. Kind of reminds me of, um, you know, uh, what is it called? 
you ever been to like summer camp or like sixth no. grade camp? No. Where like you see all these kids from different schools and we all just have one communal cafeteria. No. So I think this is pretty cool. This is really cool. If it was like this, I would have loved it. Anything to get away from my parents would have been so cool. I don't even think we have to go outside. This guy's having a blast just in the bunk bed. He's just been climbing and then carrying that pillow behind him back and forth. You little alien. That's all he's been doing, just looking through blinds. <laughs> and then crawling back over there. Do you want to go outside? Huh? Do you want to go outside, check out the lake, ride bikes? You want to do that? Or are you just going to peek through the, the blinds like a freaking weirdo and carry that, carry that pillow around? Do you want to go outside or what? Do you want to go outside? Do you want to go outside? <laughs> Come on. All right, y'all. So we're bike riding now by this beautiful lake. Sorry if it's not, uh, if I'm not bright enough. But here I am, riding. There's Papa and Taika, let's see if we can catch up. I'm riding one-handed, so bear with me. And I haven't been on a bike in years. So you might just see me crash and fall and die to my death. Just kidding. God damn, this is beautiful. Wait, Papa. Look at this. Look at the three bears. There's two this of them. This is called the Three Bears Lodge, I think. Or like that's their street name. Street name? I mean, the actual name is like the Montecito Sequoia or something. But then I saw a little uh, thing that says Three Bears Lodge. And you know what's really cute? Since it's so quiet out here, as I'm riding, all I hear is Ready to go down? Where are we going? Down that way or yeah. go up this way? No, down. That's an uphill, baby. You know we're going to have to go uphill. There's a car though. coming too. We're going to have to go uphill if we go downhill. Okay, then let's just stay here. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Fine, uphill? No. So we just come downhill? No, not uphill. Okay. Back There's back. a car coming. You told me that already. Oh, okay. Sorry. I'm nervous. Okay, I'm nervous. And that's the car I'm talking about. All right. Sorry for the rough angles. I'm doing this one-handed, baby. Here we go. All right, so after reviewing that footage, I realized that was the worst, most shakiest um, footage ever, and I'm sorry if you got motion sickness from that. Right now we're in the lodging area when we showed you earlier and now they're getting ready for dinner so they're bringing out all the foods and Taika is actually pretty sleepy but it's not his bedtime yet so I turn on my Apple watch it's six it's about to be six so he doesn't go to sleep till uh, I'm so tired I'm drawing my it was 8 30 9 o'clock so we got some time to get some dinner for him Check it out guys, it's dinner time and the food's actually pretty good. Look at this. I got salad, green beans, roasted finger lean potatoes, uh, chicken and fish cheese, and also this uh, braised beef with onions. And I got two drinks. One for water because we're in a high altitude. It's easy to get dehydrated and get a headache. And then I got cranberry juice. And there's dessert, there's these bomb ass chocolate muffins with frosting on it. So it's actually pretty good and all this is, this guy's getting really restless. I gotta go play with him. I'll talk to you guys later. And that's another baby over there. Where are you going, dude? We, okay, so we're back now, right? Obviously, because I'm naked. And we're trying to make his bed and trying to fold that fleece thing into a perfect rectangle to fit in there. 
<laughs> He's so sleepy. And every time we try to fold this thing, he keeps trying to crash into this thing. Let's get it for the Taika cam right there. <laughs> Look at this guy. You okay. crazy. I couldn't even set it up. <laughs> oh my god. He just he was crying. He was literally crying and then he went. <laughs> you freaking crazy. Where's dude. Taika? Where's Taika? Taika. There he is. There he is. There he is. Okay, Ben. Throwing up gang signs. Okay, now he's crying, right? Attempt it again. Okay, attempt it again. Look over there, look at Dad. <laughs> Watch me, he's running. <laughs> Tiger, where are you? Tiger, where are you? Ah, oh, there you are. Ah, there's Tiger. You did it. Okay, can we fold it so you can go to sleep? So magically. So, I don't know how I did it, but I was able to put this guy to sleep in a brand new environment. Usually I put him to sleep in his room where it's completely dark, but I just slowly rocked him to sleep. And I sang the ABC is about 75 times. And they finally went to sleep. So this guy is out, which is good. So me and Mom are gonna have some peace and quiet and chill now. But I'll show you guys him. Oh, wait, no.